welcome to the Stoic Solution Protocol. In this series, I will give a two-minute solution to a big macro problem. The next problem I want to solve or give a solution to is effective communication, whether it's a friendship, a parent-to-child relationship, or an actual romantic relationship. I've had relationships in the past and effective communication is extremely important. So let's jump into it. Alexa, set two minute timer. Okay, effective communication. Marcus Aurelius practiced patience and listening carefully before responding to the other person. Epictetus focused on understanding, not winning arguments with others. Seneca describes speaking honestly, but with kindness and respect, regardless of your emotional state. Zeno accepted others' viewpoints without immediate judgment. Clinthesis reflected on communication mistakes to improve future interactions. Some things that have worked for me always be in a good mental frame if you're not definitely encourage the other person to let you go for a walk or let you work out before resolving a problem or a fight or a situation active listening and empathy <clears throat> even though you might be angry about something in your life Empathy comes from putting yourself in the shoes of the other person. So what worked for me would always ask that person to give you a moment to get into an empathetic state and then address the problems and try to empathize with the other person. Another thing that is very important is communication styles. Some people are texters, some people are in-person um, communicators. So it is best to leave your ego at the door and meet the other person at their communication style. Nonverbal cues. Being receptive to another person can be expressed nonverbally. Clear messages. Being as clear and direct as possible is effective in terms of communication. And lastly, being a good listener. Thank you.